it was popping YouTube history about another banger for y'all and in today's video I'll be showing you guys the brand new Yeezy which is not opening it was popping YouTube history about another banger for y'all and in today's video I'll be showing you guys the brand new Yeezy foam runner If you're new to the channel, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe so you stay tuned for every other video I'm going to be posting. I'm going to be sticking to sneaker and fashion videos. For the meanwhile, if you guys don't like it, just subscribe because I promise the in the future I'll post pranks and skits and challenges and all that too. I'm just trying to build a niche right now. So off the bat, just looking at it, it doesn't even look like a Yeezy box. It's just a basic brown box. Look at the other Yeezy boxes, I'll show you a Yeezy slide. It'll usually say slide on it in the front or 350 or 500 or whatever. And then I'll have, it'll say this in the back and then I'll have this in the front. But this shoe is a little different. They made this style reverse. So if you take out all the, the shoe, the sandal, and if you take out the piece of paper inside, you could tell they made like a reverse effect. As you can see, the foam is here instead of on the front part. And it has the runner here and it also has the tag inside. I don't know if you guys can see, let me show you. This is how it looks. It may be a little weird. This uh, The box is kind of weird, but the, the sandal is weird at itself, so. It goes with it, I guess, you feel me? So let's talk about the sandal now. To be honest, these bitches are ugly. I don't, every other reseller, sneaker channel, whatever, is posting and saying these are nice. They're capping, I'm telling y'all they're capping. Stop the cap. <laughs> Stop the cap, right? These bitches are ugly. But, I ain't gonna lie, the material is crazy. The material is actually really good and it's comf It's kind of comfortable, not, not gonna lie. They have like the little balls and Say, hold up, wait a minute. Something ain't right. They have like the little balls and You see on the, the sandals when you have like those little bubbles, I don't know how to explain it, but it makes it comfortable. Yeah, they have it on this also. And the material, it's soft too. So I'm pretty sure if you're walking in this all day, it's not gonna hurt, not gonna lie, but they're just ugly. I don't know how people are gonna style this. I wanna see how people are gonna rock these, not gonna lie. But the resale, so let me talk about the resale now. Retail price in Canadian was about $125, I would say, and 80 US. And resale, it's to the moon. It's to the moon, it's 400 plus resale value right now. And I'm pretty sure if I hold it till next year, I could eventually sell this for 1K. Even though these are the ugliest shoes I've seen, I'm pretty sure I could sell this for 1K because you're never gonna see a shoe like this. Kanye is really crazy like that. No cap, nigga. But yeah, this shoe is, it, it feels like a croc. You know those croc sandals? It feels like that, not gonna lie. The smell is good, the smell is there, it's immaculate. So, I got two size 10s in the same colorway. I wish I got the other colorway also to see the difference and which one I would feel more. But from posts I've seen, I think these ones are nicer in person, but they're still ugly. But they're growing on me, like, looking at it more and more, they're kind of growing on me, low key. Like, could wear this with some cargo pants. I don't know, to be honest, but yeah. And they're kind of stretchy, no cap, like I, I tried one of them on. I'm a size 12 and I was able to fit in these, but like they were really tight and I had to stretch them out. But like, it's still like, it was still pretty comfortable. Like if I got it in size 12, maybe if I became a high beast, I ain't a high beast yet, but if I become a high beast, I would rock these, not gonna lie, these are pretty clean. The Yeezy Foam Runner Cream Colorway.
after further review, I ain't even gonna lie with y'all. I'm starting to fuck with this shoe, bro. This shoe is it's starting to it's starting to grow on me. Not gonna lie. If I had the actually this bitch is not even expensive, but I would not pay resale price on this. But for retail price, eighty dollars US for a Yeezy, I would get them. Maybe not this colorway, but maybe like a black one. I will get it in the summer, but I would just need to see how niggas are rocking these, these sandals because I don't know how they're going to rock them, not going to lie. But yeah, I could picture something like a nice short short with a black top and a chain, maybe something like that. But I don't know. Carney's a genius, not going to lie. Like somehow he always makes, even though I always hated Yeezys, bro, I started growing a Yeezy collection. I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, bro, but Kanye got the sauce, no cap, no kizzy, bro. These shoes are really going on me. I'm a sh I showed you the cinematic, and let me know what you guys think of this shoe. If you like it, comment down below. Does it look nice? Is it ugly? Would you rock with it? Would you buy resale price? Would you buy just for retail? Even though retail, it would have been impossible if, you, if you're not a reseller, like if you don't know how to really cop shoes like that. But yeah, these are clean, not gonna lie. The only downfall is these holes, bro. If you're walking walking during a sunny day and then boom, out of nowhere, there's thunderstorms, rain and all that. RIP to you, but you're gonna have some wet and cold ass feet for the rest of the day, bro. But yeah, or else this shoe is cold. I ain't even gonna lie, bro.